Greetings from Chirac, Illinois. Armored cars safely transported both teams to Mercenary Field today, shielding them from a flurry of gunfire and the infamous Polish Grandma Gang's bombardment of sausages, hot dogs, and pizzas. What a way to get ready for kickoff. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Hexon Oilers take on the Midway Mutants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Welcome to another game day here on the MFL Network. Grim Blitzrow along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan. How you doing? Great city, isn't it, Bricks? Fantastic city. My motel even has free color TV oh, and nice. an ice machine that works. Wow. There was police tape blocking the bathroom because of the photographers in there, but other than that, no complaints. They, they give you free jelly at breakfast, too. Sounds like a real winner. And he was stuck to him like glue. Oh, my God, a man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. I've never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy. That's what you're after. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without novocaine. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. <laughs> and it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. supposed to throw the ball forward. Uh, yeah, 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 you're right. You should. Second down and ten. Ah, another interception. You should give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else combined. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest... Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crack your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, Probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives. Oh. 
Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and it's first and ten. Seven yards on that play. Second and three. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. <laughs> Crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The 10. And he scores. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I'm home. I think all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed arena from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback's gonna be hurting oh, or dead. The greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Kids, do you remember getting shoved in a locker because you wore glasses? Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Hot one, hot two. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburner. Punt returners in this league. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Hot one. And he breaks away. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wipe with a headache. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Second down and more. 
more than the QB would like. He could go all the way. Here comes the defense. He's at the 20. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. Someone better buy this guy dinner tonight because he just saved it with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. Second down and two. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Third down and, well, good luck. Right, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. Oh, what a brutal hit! Oh, seriously, man, you think you'll go toe to toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. I, I won. I kill. Deflected the ball. Second down and ten. He is fighting for every up. And he picks up about six on the play. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Yeah. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. <laughs> First and ten. This is your brain, and this is your brain on berserker drugs. Is that a bad guy brain getting? He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, mama! Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this outfit. And it's first and ten. Oh. Oh. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the top. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. The 20. He's at the 10. Man, this guy's a game breaker. He picks off the QB and returns the ball for a touchdown. That's how you do it at home, kids. Hey, man, nobody can touch you with that ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's 
first and ten. The defense falls for that trick all the time. <laughs> now they're mopping the players off the field. Literally. Second down and ten. First and ten. And he breaks away. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Bring up third and one. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. He could be. He might be. He is gone. He is not. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, win. They save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. He could go all the way. Yeah, hey, you see that move, baby? No, so you didn't. You know why? I'm the greatest. The greatest. I tell you. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Oh, it's a brutal hit. First and ten. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. Oh, that's huge. Looks like the defense has it. And one saber there. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. He broke free. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. see a lot of carnage today folks these teams have bad blood between them apparently they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck raccoon rabies blood is my thought always a player's favorite
And it's first and ten. And it was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. who goes down fighting. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Check it off my Dead Mutant bingo card. I only need one more. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but... This guy could blow it. The kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. And he just slipped away. Boom! First and ten. And that mutant just about met his maker on that hit. I thought he was made in China. I don't see any Chinese guys down there. You're a fucking moron. Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. Second and three. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Man, there's no QB. He don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Hey, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> Freak 
sneaky, fast ham and sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you shut of a bitch! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim! It's good! The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, and he, oh you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Prince's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Wow, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. And he throws that one to the sidelines. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. Straight through the uprights. Looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsanto Industries. Makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. We're back for the second half in a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. Well, the game is as close as the score indicates. Yeah, man, he's going to get on now. He almost has. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. First down and don't die. See, oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? Oh, with the brutal hit! The offense lost their last quarterback. Next time their offense comes out on the field, they will have to forfeit the game. And it's first and ten. 
broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 20, the 10. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. First down and six. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. And Midway Newtons destroyed the opposition today. There's no one left to play, so they win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Newton Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...